Today, I'm going to show you how to deal with one of the most common annoying issues in the fixed asset module, which is the error of one voucher per transaction when you go to dispose of an asset. This error has existed from AX 2012 through the longest time within Dynamics 365. I've already prepared an example. So if we go into fixed asset and we look at this new conference room table that I've put together, we can see that I have a book that's open. I acquired it for $15,000 and I've depreciated it through the month of January 2024. So now I'm going to go and try to post a disposal for that same asset. And if I go into my fixed asset journal and I open this up, you can see I've already created in the month of February a furniture disposal a disposal sale i'm getting 500 dollars for selling this and i go to hit post and we're about to get our favorite error there can only be one fixed asset transaction per voucher this has been a problem forever often what organizations will do is they'll go into general ledger parameters allow the multiple transactions per voucher temporarily post and turn it off but now there is a better solution so this exists within feature management and you need to enable this. And if I go into the module fixed assets, it is right here. There's a new feature called create separate voucher number for journal lines related to automatic depreciation adjustment, split transactions, split disposals. What you just need to remember is to create separate voucher. This was added in September of 2021, and I'm gonna go ahead and enable this. Now let's go back to that journal. And once again, I'm gonna hit post, and now you can see it posted, and the system automatically created that depreciation adjustment with a new voucher, a fantastic piece of functionality that puts to end a lifelong struggle. Thank you very much.